Have you ever wondered about the second largest living shark, the basking shark, and how it got its name? Well, prepare to dive deep into the mysterious world of these gentle giants of the sea. The basking shark, or Satornis maximus if you fancy the Latin, is an awe-inspiring spectacle. These colossal creatures can grow up to 40 feet long, rivaling the size of a school bus. Imagine encountering a creature larger than the great white shark, yet as harmless as a goldfish. That's the paradox of the basking shark for you. These giants are a sight to behold, their size dwarfing most other sea creatures. To put it into perspective, they are twice the size of a fully grown giraffe and weigh as much as three African elephants combined. Yet despite their intimidating size, these creatures are known for their docile nature and lack of interest in human divers. So how did this gentle giant earn the name Basking Shark? You might envision them sunbathing on a beach, but the truth is far more fascinating. The term basking refers to their feeding behavior. They are often spotted swimming near the surface of the water, their enormous mouths wide open, basking in the rich soup of plankton. It's a sight that's as eerie as it is mesmerizing. But don't let their languid swimming style fool you. Beneath the seemingly slow exterior lies a powerful creature capable of diving to depths of over 3,000 feet. That's deeper than the height of the world's tallest building, the Burj Khalifa. These sharks are indeed a marvel of nature, a perfect blend of power and peace. They serve as a reminder of the diverse and mysterious life that thrives beneath the waves, often unseen and unappreciated by us land dwellers. Intrigued? Hold on, we have so much more to reveal about these fascinating creatures. Our journey with the basking shark is just beginning. So, let's plunge further into the deep blue to uncover the secrets of these gentle giants. Are you aware that basking sharks, despite their massive size, are some of the most elusive creatures in the ocean? These gentle giants, second in size only to the whale shark, are known for their mysterious migratory patterns. Unlike many marine creatures that follow predictable paths, basking sharks have an intriguing habit of appearing and disappearing with the seasons. It's a phenomenon that has puzzled scientists for years and led to some fascinating research. During the warmer months, basking sharks are often sighted near the surface in cooler waters. Here they feed on the rich, dense blooms of plankton, their primary food source. But when winter approaches and the plankton population dwindles, these colossal creatures vanish from sight. Where do they go? That's been the million dollar question for marine biologists around the world. For many years, it was thought that basking sharks hibernate during the winter months, descending into the ocean depths. However, recent research and satellite tracking technology have painted a different picture. Instead of hibernating, these sharks embark on epic globe-trotting journeys that take them thousands of miles across the world's oceans. Satellite tracking has revealed that basking sharks travel as far as the tropics, crossing entire ocean basins in their journey. These mammoth migrations are not just a leisurely swim. They are a crucial part of the basking shark's survival strategy, allowing them to follow the blooms of plankton that form their diet. However, their migratory patterns are not just about food. Scientists believe that these journeys could also be related to mating and birthing. Basking sharks are solitary creatures for most of the year, but during these migrations they often gather in large groups, suggesting that these trips could be a chance for them to find a mate. So, the next time you think of basking sharks, imagine them embarking on a mysterious, globe-trotting journey. Their elusive nature, combined with their impressive migratory patterns, makes them one of the ocean's most fascinating creatures. These gentle giants are a testament to the wonders and mysteries that our oceans continue to offer. Do you find it baffling that the enormous basking shark, with its gaping mouth, feeds primarily on tiny plankton? This might seem perplexing at first, but it's a fascinating aspect of these marine giants' lives that makes them all the more intriguing. While the basking shark might look menacing with its wide open mouth that can reach a meter in width, don't be fooled. These gentle giants are not interested in anything larger than the microscopic plankton that fill the ocean waters. They're filter feeders, a term that refers to animals that feed by straining suspended matter and food particles from water. 
So how exactly does this filter feeding work for our basking sharks? It's a rather ingenious process. When a basking shark swims with its mouth wide open, it allows a large volume of water, teeming with plankton, to flow into its mouth. This water then passes over specialized structures in its massive gills known as gill rakers. These gill rakers act like a sieve, trapping the minute plankton while allowing the water to pass through and exit the gills. The plankton get caught in the gill rakers, which are then swallowed into the shark's stomach. It may seem like a lot of effort for such tiny organisms, but consider this. A basking shark can filter an Olympic-sized swimming pool's worth of water in just one hour. That's a lot of plankton meals. Interestingly, basking sharks don't have a strong preference for any specific type of plankton. They're not picky eaters. They'll happily feast on whatever plankton species are abundant in the water around them at any given time. This adaptability in their diet helps them thrive in various marine environments. So, even though it might seem odd at first, this giant of the sea, with its massive size and intimidating appearance, relies on the smallest of organisms for its survival. It's a paradox, isn't it? The giant of the sea thriving on the tiniest of organisms. Did you know that despite their intimidating size, basking sharks are facing threats that could lead to their extinction? The world of these gentle giants is filled with perils that they neither create nor control. Among the most significant threats they face is hunting. Once hunted extensively for their liver oil, flesh, and large fins, basking sharks have seen a dramatic decrease in their population. Even though many countries have now banned their hunting, illegal fishing activities continue to pose a severe threat to their survival. But the threats aren't just from hunters. Climate change is another massive challenge for these marine giants. As the oceans warm up, the habitat of the basking sharks is altering. Shifts in ocean temperatures can lead to changes in the distribution and abundance of their primary food source, plankton. This could force the basking sharks to migrate to new areas where they might not find enough food or face new predators. And then there's marine pollution. From plastics to toxic chemicals, our oceans are becoming increasingly inhospitable. Basking sharks, like many other marine creatures, are victims of this pollution. They can ingest or get entangled in plastic debris, leading to severe injuries or even death. So what's being done to protect these majestic creatures? Conservation efforts are underway globally. Many countries have enacted laws to protect basking sharks from hunting. International bodies like the Convention on International Trade in Endangered Species have listed them as a protected species. Nonprofit organizations and local communities are also working tirelessly to clean our oceans and raise awareness about the threats faced by marine life. However, the journey is still long and the challenges are numerous. It's a collective responsibility to protect these gentle giants and ensure their survival. After all, they play a crucial role in maintaining the health of our oceans and thereby the health of our planet. Remember, every creature, big or small, plays a crucial role in our ecosystem. So, what have we learned about the magnificent basking shark today? Well, we've delved into a world that's as vast and deep as the ocean itself, unearthing some truly fascinating facts about these gentle giants of the sea. We've seen that basking sharks are no ordinary fish. They're the second largest fish in the world, trailing only behind their cousin, the whale shark. With their gaping mouths and gill slits, they cut a distinctive figure in the water, one that's impossible to mistake. We've also journeyed alongside them, tracing their mysterious migratory patterns. These patterns are a testament to the basking shark's resilience and adaptability. They travel thousands of miles each year, braving the coldest of waters and the harshest of climates. Their journeys are epic tales of survival and endurance, a testament to the marvels of marine life. We've also learned about their unique feeding habits. Basking sharks are plankton predators, sieving the sea for their microscopic meals. With their enormous mouths wide open, they filter feed, consuming tons of plankton in a single gulp. It's a sight that's as mesmerizing as it is unique, a spectacle that's testament to the diversity of life in the ocean. But our journey has also taken us to some somber truths. We've learned about the threats facing these magnificent creatures. Overfishing, climate change, and habitat loss are just some of the challenges they face. 
Their survival hangs in the balance, and it's up to us to tip the scales in their favor. In the end, our journey into the world of basking sharks has been one of discovery and learning. It's been a journey that's shown us the beauty of the ocean and the creatures that call it home. It's a journey that's made us realize how much we have yet to understand about the sea and its inhabitants. Understanding and appreciating these gentle giants is the first step towards their conservation. So keep exploring, keep learning, and remember, the ocean's mysteries are endless.